What's up, dudes? And we're back here on some more Beyblade battles. Oh, yeah. Today, my dudes, we take both Tyranno Beats against, oh, wait for it, guys, the Fafnir Base. Are you ready for some epic battles? Ready. Then let's do it. Three, two, one, and rip. Okay, my dudes, let's see what Tyranno Beat has in store for the first Fafnir. That is right, guys. Fafnir coming back to the arenas and it's showing Tyranno B that he is the spin stealing master. Three, two, one, and rip. And there it is, my dudes. Oh, we got a nice smash attack again and again and again. But we definitely need to land most of them attacks. Spin stealing, can we do it? Yo, we almost got a spin steal win right there. Three, two, one, and rip. All right, my dudes. Oh, woo! <laughs> it jumps around sometimes a little too crazy, my dudes. Yes, the gimmick is very cool. But yo, if it doesn't hit, yo, it just loses so much stamina, guys. Look at this. It has to hit. Three, two, one, and rip. There we go, guys. This time we got a very nice... No! We got wrecked there, guys. All right, all right, all right. This is kind of the Tyranno B. I think we'll be able to beat Fafnir. Let's go. Three, two, one, and rip. All right, my dudes, here we go. See, now this Tyranno B, it's all about stamina, defense. It's all about everything that might be able to beat Fafnir. That's what this Tyranno B is about. Hopefully, in the upcoming rounds, the other Tyranno B, the original Super Smash jumping version, can burst some of these Fafnirs. This is like the backup version we need to get one of those spin stealing wins. That, that's, that's why this one is here, guys. And you know what? I just want to use this green version, to be honest. Can we do it? Can we do it? Yes, we did. I told you guys. Three, two, one, and rip. And ooh, no way. Fafnir is definitely going to have to spin still there. We literally just almost wrecked him to the point of no return. But guess what? Fafnir always spin stills. Look at this guy. Can he? Oh, he's going down. Fafnir might go down. It might not be able to spin enough. Guys, spin stealing is activated. It might. Look at this. The spin stealing is so real. I love this bait. Who's missed Fafnir? Who has missed Fafnir? Comment down below. All right, let's bring on a next Fafnir. What next Fafnir have we got in line? This is the one we have next in line. And you know what, guys? I'm going to have to bring the smash attack in. Toronto B in first. Three, two, one, and rip. And this is it, my dudes. Can we jump in? Jump in, he's jumping. It's, oh, dude, he's jumping. It's jumping too much. It is literally jumping a little bit too much there, guys. It jumped over the stadium gimmick. Sometimes it jumps over this. It can't catch it as well. Three, two, one, and rip. All right, my dudes, let's, oh. How did we miss? No! The only smash attack we actually want to hit, the first one, the massive attack power in that would have undoubtedly burst Fafnir. I have to try that again. Three, two, one, and rip! All right, guys. There we go, there we go. Can we get the hit? Can we get the hit? Oh, yes! We got the hit. That was actually pretty cool. I love this gimmick. Come on, guys. You must admit, the gimmick of this stadium is so cool. I have to burst one of these Fafnirs. Three, two, one, and rip. All right, guys. Oh! We, again, we oh, jumped yeah. over. I literally jumped over Fafnir instead of attacking him. All right, let's try and get a win with the green one. Three, two, one, and rip. All right, my dudes. Is this green Toronto beat? And it's awesome combo, by the way, able to get a win over this version of Fafnir. I think so. I think it might actually be able to do it, guys. I'm hoping anyway. Let's see if this is the time that Tyranno B can shine. You see, guys, that's the thing. Even though Tyranno B is an attack type B, just put a defensive or stamina type combo onto it and it proves that it actually is really, really good. Look at this, guys. It's still not going down, and it just did. No. Three, two, one, and rip. 
All right, guys, there we go. I think maybe this one might not be so easy to beat. Maybe this version of the Cho Z Fafnir won't be the easy win for our green random booster Toro Beat. All right, we still do have three Fafnirs, and I'm telling you, the original red Toronto Beat is going to burst one of them, guys. I, I believe this. I know the attack and power from a Toronto Beat, so I know we might be able to actually do this. Uh oh. We just lost again. Uh oh. All right, bring in the next Fafnir, and uh, yes, I'm going to have to bring this one in as well. Three, two, one, air rip. All right, my dudes. Let's see if the. Ooh! Let's see if it's that GT evolution of Fafnir is the weak point. Maybe. Nice big attacks. How are we not bursting it, guys? Oh, that's close. Three, two, one, air rip. All right, my dudes. Maybe the rubber on Fafnir is literally stopping it. Oh! Dude, no! We got to beat it. I'm telling you, the rubber is like a barricade. It's the rubber barricade, man. It's absorbing the attack power. Three, two, one, air rip. Oh, there it is. The jumps, the jumps again and again and again. Yo, that was sick. That was the ultimate jumping pattern attack right there. Yo, jumping dino attack. Wow, that was actually pretty cool. But we didn't get it, man. Three, two, one, air rip. And... Woo! Oof! Almost put Fafnir in the pocket, guys. Almost. Oh! Yes! That's what we was waiting for. A burst. And we've finally done it. I told you I was going to burst the Fafnir. Time to bring in the green Toronto beat. Three, two, one, air rip! All right, my dudes. We have completed our task. Our goal is done. We have bursted a Fafnir. Burst to smithereens it was the gt evolution as well we still do have the super king yes and when it, oh, super king is never gonna burst i just realized the super kings never burst them uh, chassis on there just never ever burst let's see if we can get a spin stealing win right here with this one no we've done so good in the first round with this version three two on air rip all right guys we did it once in the first rounds against the God Evolution. Let's see now if maybe this Tyranno Beat is losing its steam. I can't believe we actually done so well in the start and now we're going downhill. We need to spin steal our way to victory, as we say. Green Tyranno Beat, just like a T-Rex. Let's go for it, man. If we don't do this now, I kind of have lost. No, again, all right, guys. Bring in the next Fafnir. Let's go. Three, two, one, air rip. All right, my dudes. Let's, I know, I just realized. I just realized what we're facing. Yep, I just realized what we're facing. We are not going to beat this version, guys. It's not gonna burst. The only thing we can hope for is a knockout. That is what we're aiming for, a knockout. Or stamina win, because that was close. Three, two, one, air rip. Just like that, that was good. That was good, yo, all right. If it didn't have that unburstable chassis on it, I think we would have been able to burst the bath there. No joke, I think we would have been able to take it out. But yet again, it's spin ceiling, it's doing good, just not good enough. Three, two, one, air rip. And power at its finest. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. That is what you call an X generation power up attack yes just like that yo it's we're not gonna do this man i need to get a stamina win let's go three two one air rip all right my dudes let's find out if we can oh yo that was unlike this version of tyranno b normally it stays in the center yo it went for it it actually went for it guys all right i'm liking it the aggression is there the aggression is real the attacks are real. Now it's a stamina based back. But who is going to get it? Which one of these bays are going to get this win? Oh no. Oh no. Fafnir wrecked us. Three, two, one, air rip. All right, my dudes. Let's see if we 
can maybe attack. I like it. All right. I thought Fafnir was going to go on the gimmick and attack us. That would have been cool. Seeing Fafnir use the actual X gimmick on the rails would have been actually pretty epic. But it didn't. It went on it, but it did actually give us a nice attack. But we are here and we're battling straight in the center. It's a battle for the center of the stadium, guys. Just like the anime, whoever has the center has the power. And it looks like Fafnir will claim that, uh oh, it's actually a real battle right there. But he does go down. All right, my dudes. Last and final Fafnir. Let's do this. Three, two, and air rip. All right, guys. Ooh. Dude, ooh. This, I just really, I just realized this is the Fafnir with the full rubber wheel. Yes, like you can even hear it just sound. Dude, no way. <laughs> can we spin still and win? Can we do it? This is, that was close. Three, two, and air rip. And there we go, my. Ooh. Jumping like crazy, man. Guys, comment down below. Are you a fan of the Tyranno beat jumping attacks? Let us know how you guys feel about that because Fafnir says easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Three, two, one, air rip. All right, my dudes. Ooh. I, again, I don't think we're going to be able to get through this. Oh, guys. You know what? At least we burst one of them. At least we burst one of these Fafnirs. I'm actually happy with that, guys. So let's bring on the green version now. Three, two, one, air rip. All right, my dudes, let's find out what is going to go down here. I'm just going to do one battle between these two bays right here just to see who can actually win it. Guys, comment down below which Toronto beat do you actually prefer to see in the battle, the red one or the green one? I'm assuming if you like these battles for the center of the stadium with all that stamina, you like the green one. If you love that crazy attack jumping stuff with maybe bursts, then the original red Toronto beat is going to be the bear you pick. But Fafnir will wreck us once again. All right, guys, there it is. Both Toronto beats went into the stadium today. Yo, they both have their uses, but Fafnir was just too strong, man. If you guys want to see more battles like that, comment down below. But until then, we'll, we'll see, see you in the, the next episode. Do yeah.